Southeastern Data, recycling for a brighter future. E-waste defined. E-waste, electronic waste, is most easily defined as discarded electronic equipment such as computers, television, stereo systems, electrical components, and mobile phones. These electronic devices have outlived their usable life cycle and can no longer be used for their original intended purpose. However, they can be reused or recycled into a new product for future use. E-waste can be highly toxic to humans, animals, and plants. Electronic waste has been known to contaminate water, air, and dirt. This is why e-waste has to be discarded properly. E-waste is a growing problem. The amount of e-waste generated daily continues to rise because the markets that these products are produced in are quickly growing. This is not just a problem in the United States, but the whole world. From 2000 to 2005, communist-ruled China alone showed 22% growth in their usage of Information Communication Technology, ICT. Some of the top ICT countries include the U.S., Japan, Germany, the United Kingdom, France, and now China. Other Forms of E-Waste Computers are often thought of as the main contributors to e-waste, but they are only a portion of all of the e-waste that is being generated. Other forms of e-waste include refrigerators, freezers, washers, dryers, and other large household appliances. These everyday household appliances accounted for about 44% of all e-waste in 2008. As prices get cheaper on electronic devices and appliances, and as global demand increases for these items, we must make sure that we properly recycle and discard these items. If not, we will create bigger and more serious problems for ourselves and the environment. Why is e-waste different? Electronic waste is comprised of not only hazardous materials, but also scarce and valuable materials as well. For example, a cathode ray tube CRT computer monitor is full of both valuable and harmful substances. One of the toxic substances in CRT monitors is cadmium. Cadmium is very toxic to humans. In fact, cadmium has been outlawed by the European Restriction on Hazardous Substances ROHS Directive. The ROHS only has six outlawed substances. Cadmium is now one of them. Another hazardous material in CRT monitors is polyvinyl chloride PVC cabling that is used to help create circuit boards, plastic covers, and cables. When PVC is placed in a landfill or burnt, it releases dioxins that can have an adverse effect on an individual's immune and reproductive systems. Another contributor to our e-waste problem is mercury. Mercury is commonly found within flat screen monitors and televisions. Mercury has the potential to damage our kidneys, brain, and central nervous system. Not only can mercury hurt an individual, it can cause further damage by being passed from a nursing mother to their infant child. At Southeastern Data, we recycle your electronic devices both responsibly and securely. Since 1996, Southeastern Data has provided recycling and remarketing of all types of business assets, computers, and electronic equipment. We can provide pickup service to practically anywhere. If your business needs our services now or in the near future, please give us a call at 1-800-810-0432.